Hi everyone. So this video will learn how to generate a random string using JavaScript. So let's create a HTML file first. It will be index.html. You need a basic HTML structure here and a style sheet at the top. We also need a script file. Script.js. We need one button. It will be generate. And a paragraph element to display the random string. Now save it and create a style sheet here. Select body element. Display will be flex. Flex direction will be column. Justify content will be center. Align items will be center. Gap will be 10 pixels. Select the paragraph element, font weight will be bold, select button element, padding will be 5 pixel and 20 pixel. I just save it, open this file in the browser and this is the output. Now let's create a script file, it will be script.js. Select the button element and the paragraph element. So it will be gen btn. And we'll select the paragraph element. My tag, which is p. Let's add event listener to this button. Event will be click. Upon click of button, we'll set the text for the paragraph element. So we'll use inner text property and later we'll create a function get random string and we'll pass the length of the string to this method. So if we are passing 10, that means we'll get a string that has the length of 10. I already wrote this method earlier. So let me copy and paste it to save your time. So let me explain actually what is happening here. So this method is expecting a number which will be a length of the string. So here we are passing 10 and it, this method will return a string that will have the length of 10. These are the characters that will be present in a string. Initially the result will be empty. We are simply using a for loop depending upon the length. And this is a piece of code that will simply generate a character randomly from this string and append that character to the result variable. And then we are simply returning it. Now just save it, go to browser, click generate and this is the output. You can change the length if you want to. Let's make it 20. Save it, go to browser, click generate. See, I hope you got the point how it actually works. See you in the next video. Have a nice day.